Damn, my hair looks like a mess. Greetings again, guys. AJ here, and welcome to the Get Ripped or Diet Train series. And this is, of course, my kind of series. I just woke up, had a lion, because I was up early, really early, super early for the last, um, how long? Last week or so, man. That's why I haven't been posting videos, because I've been super busy just, you know, with uni stuff. Like, I've had an exam, and I've had assignments upon assignments upon assignments. But yeah, I'm back, and I've got this series ready for you guys, and I'm hoping to put out about three to two videos a week, just as many as I can, maybe even more. It just depends on how much time I get and what I can do. But what I plan to do with this series is pretty much just vlog like this, um, film my meals, uh, film some of my workouts, just film what I do and just try and make the series as fun as possible. Um, if you guys want to lean out for the summer, then you can follow this series. Maybe um, take my meal ideas, take my workout ideas and implement it into your own routine. Whatever you want, I just want to help you guys out and show you how I do and what I do on a diet. So, <coughs> sorry guys, I've had the flu for the last four days as well, man. I feel completely mashed up, man, and I'll probably look, it, look mashed up as well. Actually, no, I do look mashed up, but yeah, um, I've been dieting since last, when did I start? Last Wednesday. Today is also Wednesday, so it's been a week. I've been dieting for a week and I've already lost 10 pounds. But just because I've, I've lost 10 pounds, it doesn't mean that I've lost fat. It's just water weight, I've lost. All my water weight, I've lost all my glycogen stores because I am starting to look a little flat. And um, now the fat burning begins. And I don't want to talk too much, guys, because I don't want to make these vlogs too long. So um, that's why I didn't make an introduction video or anything. I just wanted to go straight into it. I just wanted to start the series, and that's it. So, yeah, this is the first episode of the Get Ripped the Diet Train series. I'm just going to go have a shower, all that stuff, get ready have my breakfast, show you guys what I'm having for breakfast and then we're going to head to the gym. Today is back day and I'm going to demolish back. Also guys, um, just before I show you guys what I'm having for breakfast, I just want to say that um, with these videos, they may not be consistent. Now when I say they may not be consistent, I mean that I will maybe not show what I eat on each video. So I might take photos or I might tell you guys what I'm eating or I might even put a uh, um, screenshot of my fitness pal just to show you guys what I've eaten um, if you guys want to follow me on my fitness pal by the way I'll put the um, username on the screen or the username down below in the description or even just simply say my username is AJ lift so if you want to add me up my food diary is public so you can check out what I'm eating um, also sometimes I may play around with my food diary so you might see my calories drastically drop or drastically increase um, it's because I actually make my client meal plans on my fitness pal so I tend to play around with it a bit but um, yeah anyway um, let's move on to breakfast guys um, and after breakfast I'll see you guys maybe just before I head to the gym so okay
shower done and my hair is looking absolutely terrible, man. I don't know what it is, but I get my hair cut, right? And for the first three days, it looks amazing. And then after that, it just it just doesn't look as good as I want it to look. That's why I get my hair cut every week. But anyway, guys, I'm just um, going to get ready for gym now. I actually had my breakfast first before having a shower. And um, maybe about two hours or so have passed. I'm going to train at half past two. The time right now is two o'clock. I had my breakfast at 11 o'clock, so three hours have passed. But anyway, guys, I'm just going to prepare by making my... Um, Intro and pre-workout drink, which is BCAs with two bags of green tea. Now, why I have BCAs is just to make the taste better of the green tea. BCAs are good on a cut and they are necessary on a cut, in my opinion, but not in the early stages, man. My calories are still reasonably high. I'm getting enough protein in. Um, I don't feel too catabolic, like I don't feel like my body's in too much of a catabolic state, so BCAs aren't too necessary in the early stages of your diet, um, especially when you're not doing cardio, I've not started cardio yet, but um, this is a great way to get in green tea, which oxidizes fat by 17% more studies have shown, um, I believe it does as well, um, I've been taking green tea now with my BCAs and taking it to the gym for... Um, about four days now and every time I go to the gym man um, obviously I've, I've got the caffeine from the green tea um, it gives me a great workout it gives me a better sweat and yeah it does actually help to improve my workouts and it's also benefiting my diet so that's why I've added BCAs to my um, green tea so I can drink it because I don't like green tea on its own I've got so much shit to say man in this clip that I've, 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 there's so many thoughts running through my mind man but yeah um, I'm gonna make this drink show you guys how I make it in the previous clip I just woken up before my breakfast in the previous clip I just woken up when I introduced this um, vlog I didn't get everything that I wanted to say into that clip because I just woken up and I wasn't really thinking but um, macros will be up on the screen now because I haven't showing you guys what macros I'm on for this cut and my calories and whatnot. Also, my current weight is 222 pounds. I started this diet at 232 pounds, just in case you guys care. And um, yeah, let's make this um, little pre-workout drink of mine. I haven't got a tripod on me, so let's get this little thing. Stick it on there. So first you get your water bottle, of course. And open up your water tap and fill it up with agua. Shout out to my Spanish brother, Uma Rodriguez. So I'm filling up the water bottle and it's full. So you got a full water bottle. Need that there for a second. Then I'm gonna, actually no, I need to tip a bit out. I'm gonna leave that there. That's cool. Then I'm gonna grab my green tea. I've got the Twinnings Mango and Lychee flavour. The flavour actually doesn't make a difference, man. It just, yeah, it doesn't really make much of a difference. I'm not a big green tea fan. I mean, I can drink it warm if I have to, but I can't drink it on its own, man. That's, that's the problem, like, it just, it just doesn't taste right to me, man. So, just throw that in. One, two, so you've got two green tea bags in there. Then you grab your BCAs. Now I haven't got anything to put my BCAs into my water bottle because um, the scoop is too big. So the scoop is literally this big. If you guys want to know what BCAs I'm using, I'm using Extend by Servation or Skyvation. I don't know. I'm not sponsored by them, so I don't need to promote them. So I need to get that into here. So what I'm going to do to transfer the liquid is crap. Grab my shaker bottle. Put some water into my shaker bottle. Got a bit of water in there. Take my scoop. Scoop up one scoop of BCA. Throw it into there. I think I might have overdone that a bit. Got a bit too much water in there. But anyway, oops. So then you shake it up. So, crap, okay. So I'm gonna pour this in. 
my water bottle. And there we have it guys, we've got some BCAs into the water bottle with a green tea. And now the green tea becomes drinkable, at least for me anyway. I know some of you guys can probably drink green tea on its own, but I'm not really a big fan. Man. And yeah man, like this accounts as a pre-workout drink as well. An intra-workout. Try it out. Cheers. Tastes pretty good man, it just tastes like squash really. Alright guys, so I'm on to my post-workout meal. Got some broccoli in there. With some chicken. Some broccoli in there with some chicken and some rice. There's about 280 grams of chicken. Usually I have 500 grams a day, but um, I'm gonna have 280 now and then decide whether I'm gonna have 220 later or not, but I probably won't be because I'm, I might be going Luton today. So if I'm traveling, um, yeah, I most likely won't be having it. So I'll be having this. Um, sorry about the presentation, guys. I'm just eating for fuel. Um, this isn't a food art channel, it's a workout channel, right? So <laughs> I'm gonna eat this and I've still got a lot of macros to hit. So um, I'm gonna have this and then I already know what I'm gonna have for my next meal. But once I do get the meal in, I'll show you guys. Also, um, comment below and give me suggestions on how I can make these videos better. This is the first episode, so I'm not going all out, but I'm thinking about including some of my workout footage into um, these episodes um, I was gonna do that anyway but I don't know if that's a great idea or not or whether you like you guys enjoy seeing me work out um, but yeah leave your thoughts below um, when I do start doing cardio I will be filming some of my cardio routines as well um, which are pretty straightforward but I'm literally gonna put my camera on the treadmill or whatever cardio machine I'm gonna use and just talk to you guys um, and implement that into into the vlogs when I start doing that of course but um, yeah I'm gonna eat um, this is really plain, so I'm going to add some 50% less sugar, ketchup, and some lighter than light Hellman's mayonnaise. So, catch you in the next clip. Sorry guys, I've got to mention that after my workout, I also had two scoops of Impact Whey My Protein Protein. Um, just thought I'd add that in there in case, yeah, um, I don't want to miss anything out. But yeah, I'm going to go eat my meal now, so I'll catch you on the next clip. Alright guys, so I've got one more meal left, but I'm literally strapped for time, so I need to quickly go to co-op there, across the road, grab me a sandwich and stuff, and try and hit as close to my macros as possible, because I'll be travelling after that, so let's go to, let's go to the co-op and see what we can get. Okay guys, so as you know, I'm rushing because I'm heading out of town tonight, so got me a tuna and cucumber low fat Sainsbury sandwich the macros will be up on the screen um, my overall macros will be up on the screen because this is my last meal I haven't hit my targets today but it's fine it's only just one day um, to be honest I'm not really that anal about these these things but don't imitate me and don't copy me um, unless you have to like I do this lifestyle for convenience so of course today isn't convenient for me to be eating my meals properly I mean, I've got most of my protein today from shakes. Um, I wouldn't recommend that, get most of your protein from food. That's what I normally do, but today's just been one of them days. I'm in a rush. Um, and I actually had half a kilo of chicken prepared for me, um, but half a kilo went missing. I don't know what happened to it, man. Um, I asked my chef, look, what happened to my chicken? And um, I don't know, maybe it got used, I don't know. But yeah, it's just been one of them days. I'm gonna end the video here. Um, like I said guys, this is the first episode, this is just a warm up. Please leave your suggestions below on how I can improve this because I really want to make this series a success and that's what I plan to do. I hope to make these videos more entertaining and do as much as I can. Like I said in previous videos guys, I wish I could do this every single day but I'm lacking resources. I don't, I don't live alone and I'm Asian so if I'm at home and my family are there, my dad's there, I'm not going to pull out my camera and start vlogging man, that's mad disrespectful. So I'm going to do as much as I can and do what I can and hopefully try and keep you guys updated from three to four times a week and make the series successful. 
and give you guys before and after pictures along the way hopefully and try and inspire you as much as possible but yeah I'm gonna leave it here eat my sandwich and catch you guys on the next video don't forget to comment like share and subscribe and once again welcome to the get ripped or diet trying series catch you on the next one